That's the moment state troopers opened fire on a local man. Police say he was armed and started shooting at them last week. But we have obtained the video that may contradict that. Luke Jones has a story you'll see only on Local 12. Hey, please, get your hand away from the gun! Kentucky State Troopers at a house on Ambrose Road in Gallatin County Friday evening. Guns trained on a man in the yard next door. I'm going to say right about here. But it's what happened moments before that's in dispute. Next door, Stubbs' neighbor and attorney Grant Axon listens with his family as shot after shot rings out. I think there was 42 shots. 42 shots between three troopers. That's correct. Most went flying into the house Stubbs shares with his parents. One grazed Stubbs' head. Another hit one of his arms. He was not moving at all. Uh, was very concerned with as many shots as had been fired that he was not alive any longer. Police say Stubbs was armed, which Axon doesn't deny. He needed some, some help. But he says Stubbs insists he never fired his weapon, something even these state troopers seem to concede. Can you get any rounds up? No. No, just us. Axon says that's an admission that his client never fired at troopers. But Saturday, more than 15 hours after the shooting, police put out this statement. It clearly says Stubbs did shoot and the troopers shot in defense. When I saw that statement that, that he had, the troopers had rolled up, he had fired at them and they returned fire, you know, I, I, was, I was really very angry because that's not what happened and I knew that's not what happened. We asked police about that apparent discrepancy and whether they had viewed this video, which Axon says he gave them. They never replied, and for Axon, that silence is deafening. In Gallatin County, Luke Jones, Local 12 News. Stubbs got out of the hospital Saturday and went right to jail. He's charged with attempted murder of a police officer.